Good morning, everyone, and welcome to this morning's sitting. There is a tradition that when a person sits down to meditate in Buddhism or sits down to participate in a retreat, that one would first uh, begin with one's attention very wide, broad, out across the lands to appreciate and be grateful for the wide support that uh, makes it possible for us to be in this spot, in this very particular spot where we're sitting in order to meditate and practice. And this idea of starting very, very wide and then beginning to come in closer and closer until we're sitting in this body and this body becomes our meditation hall or or this body becomes our temple or the sacred ground in which we navigate our practice. And that wide, wide kind of beginning of appreciation, I've gone out as far as to the universe, the wide universe, the sense of that goes beyond the stories of even this galaxy or this world or this week or whatever is happening and appreciate the vastness within which uh, we have been, I have been participating, this, these atoms and participating for so long and the amazing process that has brought, that supported what's, po- what's possible has come together here. And then to appreciate the unseen and seen uh, uh, processes and forces on this earth of our own and how they support us and have made possible this life of ours and uh, our life here. And to value and appreciate and uh, have certain gratitude in spite of all the challenges this globe has these days in our human family, to uh, also to appreciate that we are supported uh, on this planet in so many different ways by the forces of nature and other things. And then they come in closer and appreciate and value that there are human beings in this world who are the helpers, who are the supporters, who in seen and unseen ways make our our daily life possible and uh, make all our, uh, many of our needs met and supported and our ancestors who very efforts to live and pass on their genes and their wisdom make it possible also you know, here, they're pointing, all things pointing here because this here in your body is where we are. That's where the lived experience of all this wide support is we can experience for ourselves. And then um, to come closer in, closer in and to feel the more immediate people who maybe have made it possible for us to sit and meditate this morning. And then to come closer in and appreciate this body that we have. Have some gratitude or at least appreciation that this body is an amazing, uh, amazing thing. This body that we have Uh, is within it. It contains and processes and holds and supports a tremendous process of physical, psychological, emotional, and spiritual processing and opening and unfolding, if we allow it. If we get too close into the mind and we think of ourselves consciously or unconsciously as the story-making person, as who we are is the mind's capacity to make stories, to judge, to make conclusions, to analyze, to predict the future, to remember the past, and we limit ourselves to that world, it can get sticky very quickly. But the here is where if we can open up and let the body be, be a being, an embodied being, and as broad and as wide as you can in this body. So sitting upright or 
taking a posture that's appropriate for you that expresses some little bit more alertness than you normally would have. And a posture that allows you to relax. The principle about sitting upright is to have the spine be alert and then let the muscles all around the spine and the shoulders to hang from that upright spine. Gently closing your eyes and taking a few long, slow, deep breaths. Breathing in deeply and then gently extending the exhale as far as it's comfortable for you. Inhaling and feeling the body stretch and open. And exhale, settling into this body, relaxing. And this deeper breath at the beginning is also a reminder that this is the real meditation hall. This is the location of practice that everything else is supporting, that everything else in some way comes to rest, comes to resolution, comes to awakening here in this body. And then letting your breathing return to normal. And take a few moments to scan around your body and to notice if there's any obvious places that you can relax. Maybe as you exhale, you can relax your faces of your muscle, of your faces, the muscles of your face. Perhaps you can relax and soften around the shoulders. Perhaps softening and relaxing in the heart, heart area. Softening in the belly, letting the belly hang forward and a little bit be settled down into the pelvic cavity. And perhaps there's some broad global way of relaxing the whole body no longer bracing against life or appreciating that in some way or other it's a job well done that now that you've arrived in your meditation. Not an easy thing for people to do. What a good thing that you're doing sitting here now for these minutes. And then, if it feels most comfortable for you, you can just let your attention be with your body in a global way. Just open, relax. Whatever way your body appears that allows you to feel grounded and centered. And keep coming back to that resting there.
And then to, if you'd like, to feel and recognize how the body experiences breathing. Allow the body to experience breathing. Where is the breathing experience most alive for you or most pleasant for you or clear? might feel, experience the breathing mostly in the chest as it moves, mostly in the belly as it moves, or perhaps the air going in and out through the nostrils. Or more globally, all of this together If you have trouble with being with your breathing, finding it, staying connected to it, you might put your hand on your belly, or maybe your chest, to feel the movements there. And then let your hands, your loving hand, remind you for a few minutes to to experience and be, to accompany your breathing. One of the little tricks, keys for this practice of mindfulness is to be happy every time you can start again. So if the mind wanders off in thought, begin again with your breathing as if it's the first time.
perhaps every time you exhale, to quiet your thinking, soften, softening your thinking, softening the thinking muscle. And if it's easy enough to let go of your thoughts as you exhale and let go into the body breathing.
relaxing the thinking muscle, quieting your thoughts just a little bit, and opening your awareness globally to your body. Kind of wide, soft awareness, attention or glow or vibration of the, of the whole body, whatever way you experience it. Sitting here in this spot. Your body is always in the present moment. Your thinking mind is often not. It's wandering off and thinking about the past and the future. Your thinking mind is reacting and making stories. The body is wise. The body is, can hold all things, has amazing capacities to trust, entrust yourself to the whole body. And then within the body, to feel the body breathing. And as we come to the end of this sitting, to take a few moments again to experience your body, experience how you are right now, and consider any of the ways that you've benefited from this meditation session. Are you a little calmer? a little bit more present and aware, and aware, a little bit more connected to yourself, or connected to something valuable within you, which is bigger than who you are. Or you're a little bit more patient, or a little bit more understanding of the challenges that you have or challenges in meditation. Of all these benefits, how can, how can that be a, a support, a, an encouragement, a way in which as you go through your day to day, you could bring benefit and care and attention to how you live, how you take care of yourself, how you take care of the place that you live, how you might be caring for if there's people you live with, 
or people that are in the neighborhood or out broad or out in the world? Are there simple ways that how you are now can inspire you to make the world a better place? And then to end the sitting, you might again take a few long, slow, deep breaths. Connect to your body. Feel this place that you're sitting, meditating. The contact with your pillow, your cushion, chair. And then As you wish, you can now open your eyes to end the meditation. I won't ring a bell because the bell ended up out of reach for me sitting here.